सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई क्रिएट एब्स्ट्रैक्ट आर्ट इफेक्ट गाइस दिस वन दैट्स माय कूल एब्स्ट्रैक्ट आर्ट गाइस आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ इफेक्ट सी गाइस दैट्स माय जीएस डिस्प्लेसमेंट टेक्सचर एंड गाइस क्रिएट कांसेप्ट आर्ट सी ओके सो गाइस आई शो यू माय फाइनल रेंडर गाइस दैट्स माय फाइनल रेंडर एंड दैट्स माय ब्लू कलर रेंडर राइट so now okay so guys create new composition so go to file and create new and general yes and guys delete your camera and light yeah so guys select this one that's my simple cube so guys go to on edit mode and right click go to subdivide it so guys number of cuts i increase like 10 and one more time right click subdivide it and number of cut guys i take 4 yeah right simple okay so guys now next one go to on here that's my modifier and you subdivide it subdivision surface yes and guys render i like 3 and viewport level like 2 is good yes and next one guys i use displace this one that's my displacement yes and create new yes and guys coordinates use uv map yeah and guys see that's my strength strength i like 0.2 that's it guys right see that's my cube and next one guys i apply js displacement texture guys i show you my textures see guys that's my first one second one color texture and that's my normal map texture normal bump right so guys dotted grid texture right okay so now guys go to on here so texture properties and open guys apply simple first texture this one that's my height so open yeah right okay so guys next one go to mapping and repeat x i like 2 and y 2 yes okay simple and now guys go to on shading here guys i create more beautiful cube so apply color texture so select this one so guys select this principal and press control t yes and apply texture guys apply color texture color texture so go to on here color and open image yes and guys same repeat scale i like 2 and y12 yes right see it's good okay so guys next one this time go to on up and guys select your nodes and shift d copy yeah so guys go to on add and type guys use normal map select this one normal map yeah and guys connect with this one color to color and normal map connect to normal yes Okay so guys go to on here that's my texture and guys this time i apply normal map texture this one normal png so open yes and color space this one guys use none color yeah right see it's good okay so now guys i create side lighting effect so this time i use mix shader effect mix shader yes and use animation animation yeah and guys connect this one shader guys color i use orange color and one guys strength i like 20 yes right see guys that's my cube okay so next one guys i use color ramp color ramp and go to our top select this color connect with this one face yeah but guys see that's not working so now guys see that's my normal map texture connect with this one so go to on here connect with this one yes right okay so guys i change this time color ramp so go to on here yes and increase strength like this yeah and now guys little bit down 
सो गाइस चेंज दिस ब्लैक कलर पोजीशन या गुड एंड गाइस क्लोजर यस सी गाइस दैट्स माय ब्यूटीफुल शेड ऑफ दैट्स माय साइड एमिएशन राइट आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ क्यूब या ब्यूटीफुल गाइस राइट ओके सो गाइस माय फाइनल क्यूब इज फिनिश्ड नाउ गाइस आई चेंज this one metallic i like one and roughness 0.314 yeah see guys that's my metallic effect right okay so guys my cube is finished that's my final cube and now guys go to on layout layout guys this time i apply array effect and guys go to on here and now guys use array yes guys array count i like 3 and factor this one little bit increase like 1.2 yes and guys go to on here again use array yeah so guys array count i like three so guys i change this one factor 0 and by one like 1.2 yes see guys that's my cubes right and next one guys i apply one more array effect so array and guys this time count like 3 is good so guys factor so 0 x1 so guys z1 this one i like 2 increase yeah much better see guys that's my array effect and little bit decrease like guys i like 1.5 yeah much better See guys, that's my bunch of cubes. And now, guys, go to an array and apply, apply. Yes, and second one array, apply. Yeah, and third one apply. Yes. See guys, that's my cubes. And now, guys, I create separate cubes. So press Tab and second one go to an edit mode. Yes, and press P. Guys, lose part. this one okay so guys see that's my all cubes right it's really beautiful and guys i show you my viewport shading yes it's really good okay so now guys i go to on again one more time shading mode yeah and guys this time set your layout like guys select this one and delete and delete yeah and guys and right click on here joint yes and now guys go to on here and i use plane and plane size increase so guys size increase press s letter and set your plane size yes and press yeah okay so next one guys create randomly cubes so shape position change position guys randomly change like this and create position change position yes guys select this one and change yeah it's really good right see guys i create randomly position so select this one like this and this one yeah it's good right see guys that's really simple and guys also change this time scale size you can change scale size like this yeah much better select yes see guys that's my beautiful composition closer and now guys i take camera so go to on add and use camera camera check guys go to on here and camera position change so go to on back and guys camera up yes and guys set your camera angle so select your camera and camera press 0 yeah so guys select and press 0 and all rotation 0 and set your position yes and go to on here guys little bit back Yeah, much better. 
right and guys go to on focal length i like 35 yeah great so guys closer z1 closer yes and guys go to on here cube position change like this and guys also you can increase position size increase size this one and like this right it's really good okay so guys my composition is really good now guys i take this time cylinder this one and cylinder radius guys this one i like 0 0.002 yeah and depth i like guys take 15 yes all is good see guys that's my cylinder this one and again i use array yes and guys count increase like seven is good yeah and increase the size like this i like five is good five yeah and guys go to on top view and guys set your position like this so guys cylinder this one and go to on here yeah guys little bit increase size array size like seven yeah seven is good yes and now guys i apply material white material white emission material so emission and color white guys strength like 25 yeah and guys duplicate press ctrl c and v go to on here and one more time duplicate like this guys select all cylinders and duplicate and apply on here and change position like this yeah okay so now guys this time one more time duplicate and rotate guys rotate your cylinders like 90 and guys go to on back yes and position change yes right see guys that's really good so select this one and this one and one more time duplicate and apply on right side composition create composition like this yeah much better see guys that's my final composition and now guys i apply material for this one and guys use white material same white material actually yellow i like yellow so delete your material and surface guys create material for this plane and i like orange color same 0 0.024 and as i like one and strength like 30 yeah so guys my all composition is finished i go to render setting and render 64 is good viewport level 32 and occlusion check guys bloom power check and surface screen check yeah see guys that's my final render that's my final composition right it's really beautiful so set your camera angle little bit camera check and camera guys little bit change position yes much better right see guys that's my final output and lastly guys you can apply also sdri image environment texture you can apply any sdri guys i have this one and apply yeah good right okay so guys that's it that's my final effect and guys you can also increase bloom power and strength like 30 yeah much better right okay so guys my final tutorial is finished that's my final render i show you my final render it's same it's same that's this one and you can also apply blue color it's really good also good so guys that's it that's my final effect is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you